sacrament most holy. O sacrament divine, all praise and all thanks giving be every moment thine. O sacrament most holy, O sacrament divine, all praise and all thanks giving me every moment. Prayer for priests. God, our loving Father, we are ever grateful to you for the many graces you bring to our community through the ministry of our priests. We implore you to bless our priests with your spirit so that they may live their call with the same faithfulness and fervor of your Son, Jesus Christ. Give them the grace they need to respond to you generously. Give our priests the grace to emulate the virtues of St. John Mary Vianney, the qualities of humility, simplicity, dedication to serve the people. Live the promises of celibate life and imitate your son Jesus in his poverty. Bless them that they may be empowered to resist every form of evil. Be close to them when they feel lonely and endure sufferings. Mary, our mother, protect all our priests just as you protected Jesus. We make this prayer through the eternal priest, Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Down in adoration falling, Lord, the sacred host we hail, Lord, ancient forms departing, New rights of grace prevail, faith for all defects applying, where the feeble senses fail to the Lasting Father and the Son who reigns on high with the Holy Spirit proceeding forth from each Eternally be salvation, honor, blessing, might and endless majesty. Let us pray. O oh God, in this wondrous sacrament, you have left us a memorial of your passion, 
Grant us, we beseech you, to survive the sacred mysteries of your body and blood, that we may ever experience within us the effect of your redemption, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. The divine praises, blessed be God, blessed be his holy name, blessed be Jesus Christ, true God and true man, blessed be the name of Jesus, blessed be his most sacred heart, blessed be his most precious blood. Blessed be Jesus in the most holy sacrament of the altar. Blessed be the Holy Spirit, the Paraclete. Blessed be the Great Mother of God, Mary Most Holy. Blessed be a holy and immaculate conception. Blessed be a glorious assumption. Blessed be the name of Mary, Virgin and Mother. Blessed be St. Joseph, a most chaste spouse. Blessed be God in his angels and in his saints. Just like a child. Who trusts his father dear And do delight To feel his presence near Just like a child Whose mind has not a doubt And whose heart is never proud You're I come In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, and the love of God, and the communion of the Holy Spirit be with you all. And with your spirit. Today we are going to celebrate the feast of dedication of the Latin Basilica, Rome. It is a cathedral church of Rome and it is a cathedral church of our Holy Father. Though our Holy Father is a Holy Father for the Universal Church, he is also Bishop of Rome. And each diocese has got a cathedral in itself. It is a sign in which we are all connected to the one holy and apostolic church. Bishops are the sign to connect the local church with the universal church. Through the sacrament of baptism, we are also received into this one holy and apostolic church. 
and with the same sacrament we have also become the temple of the holy spirit corinthians chapter 3 verses 16 to 17 we read through holy spirit we become the temple of holy spirit let us reflect as we read it in the first reading is our temples are flowing blessings for others or it is a den of robbers as we read in the gospel reading my dear brothers and sisters let us acknowledge our sins and so prepare ourselves to celebrate the sacred mysteries i confess to almighty god and to you my brothers and sisters that i have greatly sinned in my thoughts and my words in what, in what i have done and what i failed to do through my fault through my fault through my most grievous fault therefore i ask bless me the virgin all the angels and saints and you my brothers and sisters to pray for me to the lord our god You were sent to heal the contrite of heart. Lord have mercy. Lord have mercy. You came to call sinners. Christ of mercy. Christ have mercy. You are seated at the right hand of the Father to intercede for us. Lord have mercy. Lord have mercy. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to life everlasting. Amen. Today we celebrate the feast of. Latin Basilica so we recite the Gloria Glory to God in the highest and peace to his people on earth Lord God heavenly king almighty God and father We give you thanks. We praise you for your glory, Lord Jesus Christ, only Son of the Father. seated at the right hand of the father receive our prayer for you alone are the holy one you alone are the lord you alone are the most high Jesus Christ with the holy spirit in the glory of God the Father Amen Let us pray from living and chosen stones prepare an eternal dwelling for your majesty increase in your church the spirit of grace we have bestowed so that by new growth your faithful people may build up the heavenly jerusalem through our lord jesus christ your son who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the holy spirit one god forever and ever first reading a reading from the prophet ezekiel i saw a stream of water coming from the temple 
bringing life to all wherever it flowed. The angel brought me to the entrance of the temple where a stream came out from under the temple threshold and flowed eastwards since the temple faced east. The water flowed from under the right side of the temple, south of the altar. He took me out by the north gate and led me right round outside as far as the outer east gate where the water flowed out on the right hand side. He said, this water flows east down to the Araba and to the sea and flowing into the sea it makes its waters wholesome. Wherever the river flows all living creatures teeming in it will live. Fish will be very plentiful for wherever the water goes it brings health and life teems wherever the river flows. Along the river on either bank will grow every kind of fruit tree with leaves that never wither and fruit that never fails. They will bear new fruit every month because this water comes from the sanctuary and their fruit will be good to eat and the leaves medicinal. The word of the Lord. Be to God. Psalm response the waters of a river give joy to God's city, the holy place where the Most High dwells. The waters of a river give joy to God's city, the holy place where the Most High dwells. God is for us a refuge and strength a helper close at hand in time of distress so we shall not fear though the earth should rock though the mountains fall into the depths of the sea response the waters of a river give joy to god's city the holy place where the most high dwells the waters of a river give joy to god's city the holy place where the Most High dwells. God is within, it cannot be shaken. God will help it at the dawning of the day. Response, the waters of a river give joy to God's city, the holy place where the Most High dwells. The Lord of hosts is with us. The God of Jacob is our stronghold. Come. Consider the works of the Lord, the redoubtable deeds he has done on the earth. Response, the waters of a river give joy to God's city, the holy place where the Most High dwells. Second reading, a reading from the first letter of St. Paul to the Corinthians. You are God's building. By the grace God gave me, I succeeded as an architect and laid the foundations on which someone else is doing the building. <clears throat> Everyone doing the building must work carefully for the foundation nobody can lay any other than the one which has already been laid, that is Jesus Christ. Didn't you realize that you were God's temple and that the Spirit of God was living among you? If anybody should destroy the temple of God, God will destroy him because the temple of God is sacred and you are that temple. This is the word of the Lord. Please stand for the gospel acclamation. Hallelujah to the Lord. Sing Hallelujah to the Lord. Sing Hallelujah. Sing Hallelujah. Sing Hallelujah to 
the Lord. I have chosen and consecrated this house, says the Lord, for my name to be there forever. Sing hallelujah to the Lord. Sing hallelujah to the Lord. Sing hallelujah. Sing hallelujah. Sing hallelujah to the Lord. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Saint John. Chapter 2, verses 13 to 22. Just before the Jews' Passover, Jesus went out to Jerusalem, and in the temple he found people selling cattle and sheep and pigeons and money changers sitting at their counters there. Making a wipe of some cord, he drew them all out of the temple cattle and sheep as well, scattered the money changers' coins, knocked their tables over and said to the pigeon sellers, Take all this out of here and stop turning my father's house into market. Then his disciples remembered the words of scripture, Zeal for your house will devour me. The Jews intervened and said, What sign can he show us to justify what you have done? Jesus answered, Destroy the sanctuary, and in three days I will raise it up. The Jews replied, It has taken 46 years to build this sanctuary. Are you going to raise it up in three days? But he was speaking of the sanctuary that was his body. And when Jesus rose from the dead, his disciples remember that he had said this and they believed the scripture and the words he has said. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Of a tree, hymn number 63. On the pattern with the horse, I offer up my lowly hands. All my life, my deeds, my thoughts, thine shall be as my dear brothers and sisters that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice from your hands for the praise and glory of his name for our good and the good of all his holy church. Accept we pray O Lord the offerings made here 
and grant that by it those who seek your favor may receive in this place the power of the sacraments and the answer to their prayers through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your heart. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just our duty and our salvation. Always never bear to give you thanks, Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God. For in your benevolence you have pleased to dwell in this house of prayer. In order to perfect us as the temple of the Holy Spirit. Support by the perpetual help of your grace and resplendent with the glory of a life acceptable to you. Year by year, you sanctify the church, the bride of Christ, foreshadowed in visible buildings, so that rejoicing as the mother of countless children, she may be given her place in your heavenly glory. And so, with our angels and saints, we praise you as without end, as we acclaim, Holy, 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 God of powers, heaven and earth are full of your glory. Hosanna in the highest. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the highest. You are indeed holy, O Lord, the fount of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, these gifts we pray by sending down your spirit upon them like the dew fall, so that they become for us the body and the blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread and giving thanks, broke it and gave it to disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice and once more giving thanks, he gave it disciples saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it. For this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of our faith. When we eat this bread and drink this cup, we proclaim your death, O Lord, until you come again. Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of a death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that, partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity together with Francis, our Pope, George, Anthony, Samir, Archbishop, and all the clergy. Remember also, brothers and sisters, who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who have died in your mercy, welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all. We pray that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, the Mother of God, and our spouse in Joseph, with the blessed apostles and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, may merit to be coherent with eternal life and may praise and glorify you through your Son Jesus Christ. Through Him and with Him and in Him, O God Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, 
All glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen. At the Savior's command and formed by divine teaching, we dare to say, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and save from all distress as we wait the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior Jesus Christ for the kingdom, the, the power, power and the glory are yours now, now and forever. forever Lord Jesus Christ who set your apostles peace I leave you, my peace I give you look not on our sins but on the faith of your church and graciously grant a peace and union in accordance with your will who live and reign forever and ever Amen the peace of the Lord be with you always and with your spirit. Let us offer each other the sign of peace. Peace be with you. <coughs> Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, grant us peace. Behold the Lamb of God, behold him who takes the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to supper of the Lamb. But you should enter my roof. But only say the word and my soul shall be healed. May the body and blood of Christ keep us safe for eternal life. Amen. Like the woman at the well I was seeking. For things that could not satisfy And then I heard my Savior speaking Drop from my well That never will run dry Fill my cup, Lord I lift it up, Lord and quench this thirsting of my soul. Bread from heaven, feed me till I want no more. Fill my cup, fill it up and make me all. There are millions in this world who are craving the place Please stand and surrender ourselves at the foot of Mother Mary by saying, Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are amongst men, and blessed is the foot of thy own Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now and ever, it shall be world without end. Let us sing together. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria, Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. Ave, 
આવે આવે મારી આવે 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 મારી લેદસ પ્રે O God, who chose to foreshadow for us the heavenly Jerusalem through the sign of your church on earth, grant we pray that by our partaking of this sacrament, we may be made the temple of your grace and may enter the dwelling place in your glory through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. May Almighty God bless you, the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go in the peace of Christ, the Master Sender. Thanks be to God. This is Sessional Hymn number 178. Noi not, noi not, ya the temple Noi not, noi not, ya the temple Noi not, noi not, ya the temple You are the temple of the Holy Ghost Filled with grace, filled with grace Filled with grace, filled with power, filled with glory Filled with grace, filled with power, filled with glory You are the temple of the Holy Ghost Let us pray for our parish priests for all the families